would you welcome first into the blue corner a representing the Semtex gym, maybe Faisal! And would you welcome his opponent into the red corner a representing Lumpini top team, Darren Amstein! A-class rules over five three-minute rounds of action. Faisal in the blue, Anstey in the red. Well, that's right. The stage is set for these two. It's Jokau in Southampton. Uh, I can't see this one going to the end. Can you, Malcolm? Well, I couldn't last. I, I saw Darren's last bout, which I don't know whether you heard, was an absolute war. He was dropped twice in the opening two rounds and then came back and actually won the third round. And again, it was toe-to-toe, -to -toe, so heavy. It wasn't under A-class rules, it was K-1. But still, Darren was dropped in the first, and I think dropped in the second. And then in the third, almost destroyed his man. It was an incredible battle. And both these two are capable of it, because on the same show, I've, I've seen Mehdi Faisal as well, and they have a similar style. But as I must stress again, Danny, this is under a completely different rule set. You don't often see the best tie fights at these sort of weights and above, to be honest with you, Malcolm. Good high kick, put him off balance. Nothing more than that, though, I don't think. But um, like I say, in these weight categories, tie fighting is usually better in the lighter categories. But these well, I, two look like they've got power. Well, I spoke to Darren before this one and I said, look, I know you lost, but it was a great fight last time. I said, well, I was really rusty. I've got that out of my system now. He feels he's really going to put on a performance tonight. And that was heavy body shots from him. He, he is a powerhouse. He wasn't lying to you, Malcolm, was he, mate? No, he did say. He said, I've got that rust out, Mount. Watch me tonight. And, you know. But no. Faisal's a live wire as well. Yep, yeah, Steve Semtex over there in the corner. Mr. Gladstone himself. Uh, good master craftsman of the sport. And he will have his fighter ready for here tonight. Well, I just think these men will be happy to stand and trade in that pocket. Danny, because as, as you said, at this weight, they won't want to be expending unnecessary energy. No, I'm sure we'll see more kickboxing than we'll see my tie in here at this weight, like I said before. But that's good for everyone to see here. And now they go to clinch. Nice, even to the floor there. If I'm going down, you're coming with me. And they touch gloves. And again, over the three minute rounds at this weight, cardio is key. All that oxygen to these bigger muscles, Danny. Good knee to the body from Anstey and a knee as well. Both scoring shots. And Faisal will be getting angry with that. I thought for a moment I saw um, Darren wiping his brow there with his glove. I think it must be just what I thought it might have been blood, but it's not. And there's those. Oh, and the, the round kick. He's wobbled. He's wobbled Faisal with that kick. Yeah, he's on. Light legs at the moment, and still comes in with a big elbow to try and do it. 12 to 6 elbow again. Faisal coming back with big strong hands. I told you he was tough, and I had a feeling this would be the sort of bout this was, Danny. And it was a delayed reaction. The punches were heavy, but the round kick to the top, to the crown of Faisal's head, that's when his legs finally just started to buckle. Darren saw that and threw everything but that kitchen sink at him. Blood on the face of uh, Anstey, but I don't think it's his. I think it's Faisal's, but at the moment, Faisal's got a cut to the top of his head, but I don't think that'll bother him. No, that was definitely from that elbow, but do you see what I mean about the style of both men? Faisal, legs going, Anstey comes forward, absolute powerhouse performance, and then Faisal turns around and throws back like an ox. Well, it was a case of he went on wobbly legs, I'm sure he blacked out for a second there. Anstey went at him, didn't manage to find the shot to get it on target and be that accurate. Gave him that couple of seconds to come back. Oh, he's called it off for the cut. I can't believe it. Must be the damage, Danny. It must be deeper or wider than we possibly thought, that cut. But this fight has been called due to Dr. Stoppage in favour of the red corner, Darren Anstey.